Red flags and lifeguards are up today in Gulf Shores as Alberto moves closer to making its landfall. But even these red flags can't keep people from off the beach from celebrating this Memorial Day weekend. We've been watching the weather and we've seen it's supposed to get bad here in the next few days and we just wanted to enjoy the beach for a couple days. And Many families, just like the Sample family from Missouri, braved the conditions and came down to Gulf Shores to salvage some part of their Memorial Day vacation. Even with sunny skies shining down on the Gulf Shores, the risk of rip currents is still high. With red flags flying and lifeguards on duty, the city of Gulf Shores is stressing the importance of beach safety for the holiday. The biggest thing is when they come to the beach, look at the flags and see what flags we're flying. Today we are flying red flags for high rip current forecast, as well as the surf behind me. This surf has built since yesterday afternoon, so the dangers are little kids getting hit, knocked over by waves and getting pulled out by the back rush as it goes back to seas. Even though many tourists came down to the beach, most were down to just enjoy the scenery and didn't want to chance the rough surfs caused by Alberto. Uh, no, not today. <laughs> Did yesterday, but I don't think I'm braving it today. No, I don't get in the water most of the time anyway, but definitely not today. In Gulf Shores, Colin Cahill, NBC 15 News.